well, I finished finally the third segment of uh, this conversation the Lord had with me this past night. This past night, the Lord Jehovah spoke with me in a very, very mighty way. He took me up into his throne room. And the Lord Jehovah, when he took me up into his throne room, the throne room of God Almighty in heaven, after putting the false prophets to the sword, to the sword of God, a tremendous undertaking. Then at that time, he lifted me up into the throne room of God Almighty in heaven. And then with his own hands, with his own glorious hands, God the Father, Jehovah Elohim, Jehovah Yahweh, he took a reward and placed in my hands. And that reward was a unique gift, a unique reward. These are leaves, tremendous leaves from the tree of life. But what happened this time around is that he cut them together as a bunch and he gave them to me and those leaves were whiter than snow. Powerful, powerful, powerful. Very pure white, white, absolutely white. White leaves. White and snow, totally glorious leaves. He cut them with his hand, a bundle, and he placed them in my hand. And he said, these are for the healing of the nations. And then after that, he again took me towards the tree of life. And I saw a tremendous flourishing of the leaves of the tree of life. Now, the white, tremendous, glorious leaves from the tree of life, the leaves that became very super glorious and absolutely too holy, very holy, the leaves that were white and glorious, the leaves from the tree of life that Jehovah God the Father laid in my hands, they were so powerful, so glorious, and they finally now, they sprouted out. I could see flowers growing from them. Flowers began to grow from the white, glorious leaves. So I could now see white flowers, white, glorious flowers. They began to bear flowers, bear flowers, bear flowers. So I saw the leaves sprout in a very powerful way, in a very tremendous way, white, super glorious leaves as glorious as the glory of the Lord, tremendously glorious. When I touched them, my hand became glorious. But then eventually now, they began to sprout out flowers from those leaves, the white, super glorious leaves of the tree of life that God the Father placed on my hand, now sprouted out white, super glorious flowers. So that means it will be a tremendous, tremendous visitation this coming weekend. This coming Sunday is going to be very powerful, very historic visitation, a historic healing service here and all the way to Australia. May the Lord bless you, beloved people, and all people can partake of this across the world, across the nations of the earth. May the Lord bless you, the Messiah is coming. This is the third and final segment of this conversation that the Lord had with me. The white super glorious leaves, the bunch that he tied together, a lot of them, a huge bunch, and placed on my hand and became super glorious, very white. They began to bear flowers. Eventually they bore flowers, they sprouted, they flourished, and they blossomed, and they now began to grow white, super glorious flowers.
But when I looked at them now, eventually, from a place after the flowers have sprouted, all over, all of them, the flowers, nice flowers ahead of them, ahead of them, standing, standing, standing. When I looked at them now from a distance, then I saw that they were glittering, shining, things like diamond, things like diamond, shining, small, small glitters on them. Pure white, glorious leaves of the tree of life have sprouted super white, super glorious flowers. But when I looked now, I could see small, small diamond like dots, dots. That's just the level of purity and holiness and glory of God Almighty that adorned and occupied this visitation that is coming. So this coming Sunday is going to be big, big, big in Kenya here. And all churches that will uh, want to participate in this, uh, and also all the way to Australia, even as the Lord begins to navigate me to Perth, Australia, and Melbourne, Australia. There's Messiah is coming, beloved people. All these things are happening because um, the, the Messiah is coming. The King is coming. The Lord is coming. And that's why this latter visitation, the latter glory that was promised, is now coming down to the church. And remember that I saw also heaven open and the inside of heaven with a lot of beautiful glory. And this is a sermon that I've prepared to always preach one day to preach about heaven, to preach about the kingdom of God in heaven, the glory, the beauty, the wealth, the riches of heaven, that when you hear this, you may give up anything and everything on the earth here and aspire to enter the glorious kingdom of God. But meanwhile, at hand, there is a big visitation coming this Sunday, and many, many creepers will get up and walk. Many, many blind will, eyes will pop open. Their eyes will literally pop open. Those who have no socket, those who have no ball in the eye, and, uh, and, and many, many deaf, mute, paralytic, lame, all diseases under the sun. A super glorious, massive healing anointing is now coming to this tremendous ministry of the Lord to prepare the way for the glorious coming of the Messiah. Beloved people, the Messiah is coming. Let us be ready. Let us be holy. Let us be righteous. Let us shun sin and bear humble hearts, hearts that are repentant in the mighty name of Jesus. Shalom to them.